All right, guys. You're in the AR. I have the flat green uh, base coat on right now. It's a rust on The cap, like I said, it's the flat green. If you want a color reference. Um, so all I did to prepare was I shot it with a little degreaser, not much. I didn't really care. You know, the, the especially with the rattle cans, the, um, the coat doesn't have to be perfect. It's gonna wear off anyways. Um, so yeah, tape up the trigger. I'm sure if you watch any AR painting videos, you've heard this, but I like to tape up the iron sights. Um, again, the trigger, don't want paint getting up in there. I, I put a piece of tape under the uh, dust cover. And for this, this paint job, this time around, because I've had this AR painted before, um, I did it with the sponge method before. This time I'm going with the laundry bag method. Seen a lot of guys use it. I really like the way it came out. So uh, we'll see how she turns out. Right now I'm kind of torn on what colors to do next. If I want to do them on the rifle or through the net. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna cut the video in here and uh, we'll be back after we paint the next layer. All right, guys. So now I've applied over the flat dark green. I've applied Rust-Oleum's, their tan color and the really dark brown. Um, it looks good, but I don't know if I'm gonna get the desired effect that I wanted and hoped for. But then again, it's just a camo paint job, easy. Easy to fix, easy to redo, all that good stuff. But, uh, yeah, we'll see. I'm going to apply it to the other side quick. This side, the dark brown. We'll see how it turns out. But there she is in step two. All right. So, I did the first layer of the netting. It actually turned out uh, really good. I'm very pleased with it so far. I still have the other side to do, but that's her so far. And uh, I'll be sure to post a video and some pictures of the finished product project because um, the stock and the pistol grip are both gonna be FDE. Um, I'm keeping the furniture FDE. Hopefully it'll look really nice, but I'm actually very pleased with the way it turned out so far, man. The uh, laundry bag method is, it's super easy and it's hard to mess up. So if you're afraid of this, highly recommended. I'm gonna flip over to the other side and I'll show you guys.